hello friends so far we have created our ionic app and deployed in android device today let's go ahead and create it create one uh, um, windows desktop application for uh, using the same uh, application so to do this we need to install the electron so you have to install the uh, unity electron just come to this website and copy and run the command using this we will uh, install the package and then we will uh, add an electron uh, platform like we did for android right so this one will basically add a platform electron platform then we will be able to open that one so that will be very easy but to create one ex file hopefully you can do that too but you need to have the windows 10 at least windows 10 and there are some few requirements i don't have windows 10 i'm running this in windows 7 so i'll not be able to do that one so let me show you how to do that and just open that application in desktop desktop electron mode uh, this command uh, npx capacitor open electron so this will open the electron version of uh, in front of us and we'll see how this will look like and using this we can definitely create any application uh, as a windows desktop app yes it is starting up and this is how it looks like never mind this this will open uh, first time and then see the responsive is also working fine let's take our take a look at the functionalities yeah this seems working perfectly so basically this is a very simple way to create one desktop app using capacitor and the electron hopefully we will be able to create kind of exe file with that one but i have not tried that one yet since i don't have the system requirements uh, come to publish section and you will see this is the guide here you need to have the windows 10 uh, system the windows 10 sdk just follow one by one this one hopefully this will work perfectly and you will be able to create the package and you will be able to run this one uh, that's it for this video hopefully this will give you some interest to look into this desktop feature desktop application feature so that's it for this video hopefully this will give you some interest in, to look into this desktop application feature please hit the like button hit the subscribe button